Happening now, do you have your green ready for St. Patrick's Day? One Northeast Arkansas City Square was full of the color today as Pocahontas held its annual St. Patty's on the Square Festival. Hayden Savage was there this afternoon and has more. Yeah, hey Alejandra, even though St. Patrick's Day is just one day away, things are kicking off early here in the city of Pocahontas. Food vendors, among other things, have drawn a crowd here in Randolph County. We're out here today celebrating uh, St. Patty's on the Square. It's an annual festival that we'll host. A large crowd on the square in Pocahontas today celebrating St. Patrick's Day one day early. We've got vendors, uh, crafts, all kinds of goodies, retail, uh, food trucks, and we've got live music. But the event isn't just to celebrate the Day of Green, but also draw people out to support local business. We've got some Irish heritage in the uh, community, and you know the weather's turning, it's a beautiful day, and just trying to give the people of Pocahontas something to come out and do. The festival has grown every year since its founding, and along with the growth in the festival itself, the crowds have also increased. We're expecting a good turnout. I'm you know, estimating probably between 500 and 1,000 people. Festivals are not only good for food trucks, vendors, and other pop-up shops, but also businesses that are on the square year-round. We've been on the square for eight years, and um, we're at every festival. They say the events like these can increase their foot traffic by sometimes hundreds if the conditions allow. It does increase our foot traffic, and um, we have lots of people. The weather, of course, if it's nice, we have more people. In Randolph County, Hayden Savage. K8 News.